Tough setback tonight for the Liberty Flames inside the Vine Center. The Winthrop Eagles come to town and beat Liberty 71-56. Flames got off to a rough start here tonight shooting-wise. Four of 20 at one point in the first half, and Liberty fell behind by as many as 21 points. Second half, Flames turned up the intensity, came out of the locker room on a 7-0 run, whittled the deficit down to single digits, but ultimately too much. Keon Moore tonight, 22 points on 6 of 18 shooting for him, and the hole was too big for Liberty to crawl out of. We had really good shots, and they didn't go in. I think the result was as bad, for sure. But we had, uh, I think, six point-blank shots at the rim. We had four wide-open looks. None of them went in. Um, and we, we don't have that kind of margin for error. We've got we've to be able to make those shots. Um, it's tough. You, kinda, you just got to stick together. You can't um, try to get it all back at one time. Um, you just got to have good possession after good possession. And I think we did a good job at doing that uh, second half. We just need to do it longer. Well, I think Coach said we started four for 20 shooting in the first half. We just couldn't make a shot. We just turned the ball over. Um, couldn't really get in sync offensively, but I think we started to figure it out in the second half and inch back at the game. Drew was the best player on the floor because of his energy, toughness, and fight. He was just flying around. You know, his shots weren't rolling in either, but he was getting work done on the glass and running the floor and got a dunk or two, and uh, he gave us a lift and kind of uh, gave us a chance because of that. On the glass, that was kind of where I was trying to help our team the most was – on the boards because we have other scores. They don't need me to do that as much. I can get some of the rim, some of the dunks, but um, I feel like that's the way I can help our team the most. We love this, we love basketball. Win or lose, this is what we love to do. That's why we're here, you know? Um, sometimes it's hard and you get down on yourself, but at the end of the day, we're here to glorify God. We're here to play as hard as we can. Um, we just win. We're gonna keep each inching at that every single day. Few bright spots to take away for the Liberty Flames. Drew Smith maybe played his most complete game of the season tonight. A double-double for him, 11 points and 10 rebounds. There were three scorers and double figures tonight for Liberty. Also, David Ando had 11, and Theo Johnson finished with 10 as well. Flames now 0-7 in Big South play. They will look for their first conference win when they hit the road to Radford coming up this Saturday. And we will have live radio coverage for you on the Liberty Flames Sports Network. Alan York providing the play-by-play -play coverage. Till then, for the Liberty Flames Sports Network in Lynchburg. My name is Nick Pierce.